another segment of me and three. This time we've got Mr. Mac behind the camera. Yeah, a bit weird me being on this side. Yep, you excited? I am actually. Bit of a challenge, I suppose. It's not me firing the questions, it's you. So I'm actually no. looking forward to it. All right, we're going to start in three, two, one. Where were you born? I was born in Morty Alec. Morty Alec? Mm. Where did you grow up? I grew up in Mafra. Spent most of my years in Mafra in the country. Nice Ipsane. country. Uh, primary school? I had three primary schools. I went to Chelsea Heights Primary School, mm -hmm. and then I went to Red Hill, right. and then I went to uh, Mafra Primary. Mafra. So your favorite primary school memory? Uh, I was lucky enough to win the school cross country, and I, I advanced all the way to the state finals, and had to make the top 10 for Victoria, but I finished 27th, which right. I was happy with. I've missed out. Definitely. Good experience. Uh, the funniest staff member at RPS? Uh, I think Mr. O is, Mr. Mr. Smith might not like that, because he's a funny man too, but yeah. Mr. O is extremely funny. Sometimes I don't know if he's serious or joking. Yeah. Uh, mum and dad's jobs? Uh, my mum was a nurse and my dad was a policeman. Oh! Yeah. Uh, family members? Uh, I've got three sisters. Three I've got two sisters. older and one younger. Okay. Uh, your favourite thing to do at school? Uh, favourite thing to do at school? Play sport. I played yeah. sport all the time. I love yeah. that. Uh, your favourite childhood memory? Uh, my favourite childhood memory, I would say, was I was lucky enough in high school, but I think it was year nine, to go to America on exchange. America? Yeah, and back then it was a tricky um, tricky time to be travelling, but um, I had a, it was a great experience. Uh, favourite band? Uh, I love Powderfinger. Powderfinger. And uh, nickname? Uh, my nickname is Macca. I go by Mr. Mac here. Everybody calls yeah. me Macca. Yep. All right. Uh, your favourite TV show? Uh, my favourite TV... Well, I'm not going to say TV show. I'll just say... I just love watching football. Footy so I'm just going to say football. Yeah. Uh, current pets? I have a dog called Max. Max. I have a lot of birds that land in my backyard. Same. Um, so we feed them. Yeah. Um, and I'm... Currently, we're looking at getting a greyhound. My kids want a greyhound, so we're looking at getting a greyhound if it's compatible with my little dog. That'd be so cool. Yeah. Uh, your best talents growing up? Uh, look, I'll probably playing sport. I always want to coach, so I coach a lot of sport now, especially football, so oh, I'd yeah. say coach. Or playing the didgeridoo, but that's a bit different. Yeah. Uh, your favourite holiday? Uh, I love going to Southeast Asia. I do like Thailand, I like the islands, mm. Bali, that sort of stuff, so I have to say that. Okay, your next holiday you're going to go on? I've already booked to go to Queensland. I'm just yes. waiting for the borders to open. Oh, so hopefully. in four and a half weeks, so we'll see how we go with that. That's cool. Uh, beach, snow or the outback? Beach. Beach? Art beach, yeah. Uh, the most famous person you've ever met? I have met um, Eric Banner. Eric Banner? Yep. Uh, your favourite sports team? Uh, the Mighty Magpies. Mighty Magpies. Yep. Uh, memorable personal achievement? Uh, I would say probably winning a premiership in football, and I coached Ooh, it. Nice. Mm. Uh, move your book. Uh, I will say movie. Uh, favourite vegetable or fruit? Uh, I will say uh, vegetable, and I'll say, um, oh, I don't mind broccoli. Broccoli? Mm. Ooh, your favourite takeaway destination? Oh, I like Indian. Oh, so I'm going to hand it over back to you? That is me in three. Alright. Now, I'm going to turn the tables a little bit here, Mark, because this is now Mr. Max Mike. It is? Are you happy to be on Mr. Max Mike? Yeah, definitely. Well, Mr. Taylor, throw up the graphic. <laughs> Well, it's great to have you here, Mark. You've got a started, we're underway. Now, we've got a bit of a thing in our school at the moment. I am not happy, and there's lots of people in the school, including yourself, I reckon, about yeah. the amount of rubbish. Oh, I hate the rubbish in the school. We've got bins. We have, and we've got bins in the classroom. We've got a few bins outside. There shouldn't be any reason why we've got so much rubbish in the school. So we've started a new plan for different parts of the school to be cleaned up by different year levels. So far, it's going okay, would you agree? Yeah, it's going good. Okay, well, what we need to do is there's two classes, they're both grade threes actually, who have won the award to start with. So, those grade three classes are actually gonna be, their prize they chose, because they've got about five to choose from, yeah. they chose to go over to the park instead of being in the classroom for one session. Definitely. So, how would you feel about going over to join them? I would be astounded. I would love to. Well, fantastic. So what Mark and I are going to do, we're going to get out of here as quick as possible and we're going to make our way over to the park. Grade threes, we're on our way. We can't wait to interview you. We're going to swap the mic. I'm going to give a Mark a chance to be uh, running the mic as well. Oh, okay. And we're going to have a chat to you guys and find out what you did right to get the reward with cleaning up our school. We're on our way. See you in a minute.